we bring to you the inspired word of God as you listen to the teachings and preachings of a servant of God, Hosanna David, preaching the end time gospel. We have been in this country ravaged by mosquitoes and there is a very good insecticide that we use called sniper. Sniper is costly, but once you sprinkle it, the mosquitoes will flee. Cockroaches will die. I now heard some months ago that they have banned sniper. Why? Because people were drinking sniper anyhow because of the loss of hope. There is no problem that has no solution. In fact, problems will always come with their solutions. A man who will always meet God in the secret will never be confused in the public. There are some children we call a Greek children. What worry call a Jebota. If they see millipedes, they will call their mommy to come and kill millipedes for them. But the original worry shy. Anywhere you go to, if you are from worry, they will recognize you. Worry not the carelas. It's true. Because when they see situations, they want to face it. I'm not talking about the rascality. You know, there are some people that we are born with silver spoon. Some with golden spoon. Some we even die with diamond spoon. There are some with wooden spoon. There are some with plastic spoon. There are some that we are born without any spoon. In fact, the spoon their fathers were born with, they borrowed it. So when they grow up, they need to pay for their father's spoons first. They pay for that one before they now start looking for their own spoons. But I tell you that we once had a president who said when he was going to school, he went to school without school. Without what? Now you talk him. He went to school without school stand standards. And I tell you today, the man is in money. Don't give up on your God. Don't marry a husband and give up on your husband. There was a man who, who was having an issue and then we talked. He said, I cannot change. This is the way I am. I have told you this is the length I can go. And we were saying, there is a problem. He said, no. But you know that a few weeks later, the woman sent me a message. I said, my husband has changed. I said, thank God. I called him. I said, thank you very much for the change. About two weeks ago, she sent me pictures of a Jeep, a car the man bought for him. Don't give up on your marriage. Don't say, this woman cannot change. If I, this woman will kill me, this man will kill me. You cannot be in a marriage and your love is somewhere else. Let me tell you, look for something good around that man. Even if it is honorary smile that is smiles in the morning and throughout that day you don't see it again, hang your love on that morning smile. And marry that morning smile. Forget about the other side. Stand on his good to walk on his bad. One day God will show up and he will cry on his knees. We are living in a time where boys... Boys are carrying laptop, 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 hustling, trying to make a living. And because there are some who are carrying laptops, Sir said, these boys, if I see you with laptop, to hell with you. And I tell you, there are many boys today who are deeply into Yahoo. Some of them don't even believe that it is stealing. Some of them don't believe. Let me tell you. Nigeria is independent. 60 years ago, are we really independent? The oil in my community, I don't know the allergy. Pocket is entering. Are we independent? Let me tell you, the definition of Nigeria's independent is that the government is dependent while the citizens are independent. For, for a country to consecutively produce mediocres for 60 years. Imagine the kind of citizens that country is going to produce. But I know we will not give up. One day God will release a man. Somebody say God will release a man. But I tell you, we are living in an earthly hell. Don't give up. God will show up even in this country. I know a man who says, what am I going to do in abroad? Because I make my cool millions here in Nigeria. God will bring your own to you.
We hope you were blessed by this message. For more information, visit our website www.hosannadavid.com. Email us at info at hosannadavid.com. God bless you.